All right, welcome back to some TFT with me, McGrathy. Um, got slamming. What well, doesn't kill you? We have a pretty strong team, so I don't really want that. Uh, ghostly crest. I think it's jeweled lotus. Honestly, I think so. We're gonna be going a Diana comp. Uh, early though, I just want to probably win. Question mark. So, we also have Exalted. I think I'm leveling up, and I think I'm putting this in as well. I think this is the best idea for now. I'm going to take the Exalted, so I'm going to take the Umbrals. Uh, we're not we're not keeping that. That's fine. Yeah, I think we have a pretty good team right now. Um, we got the two Umbrals in. We have a two-star um, Rek'Sai and a two-star Ari. We're we're pretty strong for this early. Uh, I think that's pretty good. We might get weaker when we put in the Kabuko relative to everybody else at five, but uh, yeah, I think we have a pretty strong team starting the game, so that's at least pretty good. Uh, what's my Ink Shadow Toxin? Okay, well, that's good. Um, yeah, not great Exalteds this time. Um, but we're playing Diana. So if you haven't seen my channel in the last few days, uh, we're doing a Diana only or a Diana flex team. Um, so we're trying to just, we're trying to make Diana work um, and we're testing out sort of all the different variations uh, on the Diana theme that we can do just sort of for fun and to see, um, you know, how far we can push it. Um, I think that Diana and Annie go really, really well together. I actually think Diana and Silas also go really, really well together. So maybe this is a Silas game where instead of Annie, we pick up Silas. Uh, and we get maybe another Bruiser or something. And we keep the Umbral in. We do have uh, a Loon, who's also Exalted, and an Invoker. So it kind of lends itself to Annie because Annie's also an Invoker. But we could still just go Janna and uh, not take the Annie Invoker and instead go Silas. So we do, um, we do have some options in that respect. We also do have a Rek'Sai already for the Bruiser. So yeah, if we three-star this, I, I guess that's good. <laughs> I don't really want a three-star Rek'Sai, but you know, if I get it naturally, that's fine, I suppose. Nautilus grants you gold on enemy kill or allied death. It's going to be enemy kill. 100%. Great. Oh, and two, two of these already. You shouldn't have... Uh, that's really good. Um, we might as well pick this up as well, I suppose. We have only three gold over ten, so that's fine. Uh, let's see what else is going on. I've got some mythics, some story weavers, some faded, some reapers, behemoths, story weaver, hammer. Yeah, so there's a lot of just regular story weavers early that will probably change quite a bit. Um, but I'm specifically looking for anyone who got an early Diana, uh, any, anyone who's going sages or dragon lords, and there doesn't seem to be any yet, so we'll, we'll wait and see, we'll keep an eye on it. Um, I think we still win this one, this one's a pretty hard one for us to win, but I think because we've got the Alune in the back just wrecking some faces, I think we're okay. Wow, how did we kill five units and we only got one gold? There's a 50% chance to drop, guys. Come on. I'm no actuary, but I call bullshit. <laughs> Let's get a Keanu. Who would we take out, though? Ugh. I don't really want to take anyone out. Oh, Diana with a spat. Well, I guess I'm not getting my Diana then. That's really good, but it's first to go, obviously, for sure. I would probably like to get a Gargoyles on her. Um, also, a Crown Guard is really good on her as well. Um, something with some HP, so that's why Crown Guard is pretty good. Uh, but I didn't get any of that. Instead, I'm getting one of these, which is a three cost, and it's fine. I don't really want the Titans. Um, I don't think I'm taking Bramble Vest either, but it's Bramble Vest is actually okay. Uh, all right, I'll take this. We do have two Arcanists, but yeah, I don't think I want to take this. I mean, 100 magic damage to all allies or to all adjacent enemies is pretty good. That's no joke. Um, 
but I think I'd rather have that on someone else, maybe. <clears throat> this is good on Silas, I suppose, but we really need the AP. So I'm not, uh, I'm not going to go down that route. We're just going to keep trying to get to, uh, yeah, to, to, to winning here. How many more? Two more rounds on this. Okay, I probably should have leveled up, actually, because now this guy's five. His units are okay, but not amazing. I think we don't win, though, unless we get really lucky here. No, we don't. That's too bad. That's too bad. I think we're throwing these out. We don't need them. It's nice to have the Umbral, and it's nice to have the Exalted, but I, uh, yeah, it's okay. We'll we'll pick up Exalted later if we want it. We can always get the Mumu, the Thrash, and the Kaisa. It's fine. Now we get the Kiana. Cool. <laughs> It's fine, it's fine. Um, I think we level up anyway. I think we get the Janna here. I think it's worth it. I think the Janna goes here, though. We just want the Dragon Lord later. The Invoker we get, though, that's good. Um, but I think we just want the Dragon Lord later. That's what that's really for. I'll keep this over here, just in case we do end up putting in another Exalted. I mean, if, if we get an Amumu, it's, it's a, you know... Probably better than this Rek'Sai, although if we do get a Silas, we will want another Bruiser. But I'm pretty sure we can find pretty much any Bruiser uh, to fit that category. Wow, this guy's got a Gargantuan's Resolve with two Titans Resolve already. Or Titans, whatever. Mine's pretty good. Kill this unit. Yes, thank you. Three more gold. I will take it. Roll this three cost unit, see if we can get this Diana rolling, huh? Lots of mythic, lots of other crap. Not really stuff we need though. I'm gonna have some iced coffee. This Yone is not doing super things for us. We'd like to get a little bit of gold. We will get guaranteed three gold, but we'd like a little more. See if we can get some more gold here. Oh, that's good. We need that. Those are good. Four gold, please. No, that's okay. Items are good, too. Items are good, too. Okay, that's excellent. Uh, if we can probably keep the Yone. I don't mind him at all. We do have a Warmogs. We've got another Bramble. Mm. Should we get three Crown Guards? Is that too much? <laughs> probably too much. Maybe a Gargoyles and two Crown Guards would be pretty cool. That'd be pretty amazing. We're just still leveling up here. Uh, we're still getting gold. Now we're at 50 gold, so we can chill a bit more. This is funny. This guy had his top three units in the second row for some reason. Interesting. Come on, Yone, you can do it, my friend. Nice. Okay, we'll take the Zoe again. Why not? I mean, we'll put Zoe in for the Arcanist, right? We could do it. It's fine. She goes here in the middle. She's in the maybe pile. She's in the maybe pile. Definitely don't want that. Ooh, Invoker Crest is actually really good. Combat Caster is also really, really, really good. Hmm. I think we take the Combat Caster. I think that's too good to give up. Uh, we could sell this. Let me put this in. We could do such things. Um, we're not going to keep this, right? So let's make this. Our Diana for now. What else do we want? We don't want Sunfire. Although we're not taking any, potentially, right? We're not taking any, so we might want that. Oh my god, you have three three stars already. You have zero income, friend. Okay. Okay. I uh, don't know if we beat this guy. Seems like maybe we don't. 
Uh, we may not kill him. He's a billion health. Okay, that's fine. No problem. No problem. <clears throat> Guess I could put Eco in instead, right? Probably better. She fits the tank role a little bit better. Could go Warmogs. I don't know if Warmogs on Diana is very good. It provides more buffer from basically getting deleted. But I, I don't know. Is it enough? She's not going to be the damage dealer is the problem then if we do that. I'd like her to do more damage. Right? Mm. Yeah, I feel like going full tank on her is also good, but that's not really... I mean, it's it's Diana Flex. We could go full tank, and it still fits what we're doing, because we're flexing, right? We are, we are trying to find the limits of what this champion can do. So, like, in the end, yeah, we could go full tank on her. We could go Warmogs, you know, Crown, Bramble. We could do that, and we could see what the limit is on her tanking. But I kind of like her as an AP ass kicker to be honest I think that's a little better um, we like the Lilia we like the Lilia in particular because it gives that but so does that guy like it apparently I guess uh, I also like that I think I'll take this like I was going after it so it's fine uh, I'd like a redemption on somebody Hmm. There's Diana. She showed up. Welcome, Diana. Welcome to the party. Uh, I don't think we want redemption on her. I think we will want redemption probably on you. <clears throat> now, are we taking Annie? Let's see. I mean, we have two Umbral, but like that's kind of beside the point at this point. Uh, but let's see. We do have Diana, and we have a loon. Uh, uh, Diana and a loon. We don't really. Yeah, we don't really have the the ability to put Exalted in. We do have Dragon Lords, though. Obviously, Dragon Lords are really good. We want Sages in as well. Zyra, Morgana, uh, Wukong, Rakan for. Uh, Dragon Lord and Lee Sin. So this is our eight level eight team. I think it's pretty good. It's only two invokers. If we get an Annie, I feel like that would be pretty good. But we need four invokers to make it work, so we'd have to drop something off of here. So in the end, I think a loon comes out. I you know I, I don't think she's worth. I don't think a loon is worth an Annie to be honest. So I think it's a loon early fine. But then we go back to Eddie, and we're gonna definitely sell this uh, a little bit later as well, because we don't, we just don't need it. We don't need you. Sorry, friend. We do have a spear for the Morgana, right? This turns into Morgana, basically. Yeah, this is a sort of normal flex that I would do. We're not, we're not flexing much in this one. This is, you know, pretty much what the normal comp is. Uh, we don't have much in the way of, uh, yeah, health yet, but we're doing okay. Yone provides a needed distraction, and we're getting a lot of mana, so it's okay. We might, if she can cast again. No, she doesn't get to, though, because Kog'Maw things. And Lilia things. Yikes. All right. All right, let's get this damage in. Um, we need to roll, right? There's a Janna. We probably three-star Janna because we already have, you know, half. We're halfway there already. We should get some more gold, so we'll take that. <coughs> Getting all our items. Ticky 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 ticky. I see no items that I want here. 
Good lord. Okay, we're actually not keeping a loon, so I don't need to keep getting those guys. Dragon Lord, yep. Nope. Oops, I don't need that. Just wasted money, that's fine. I mean, I'll take it for now so I can sort of keep going. Uh, I want to keep this, right? So we need to stop there, sell this eight. Um, I am tempted. Let's just take all of these. Uh, and let's do that. <clears throat> okay, blue buff and death blade. Not ideal. Uh, definitely not ideal. But it's okay. We'll be fine. Do we kill this Nar? No, he's two star Nar. With perfect items and gargantuan's resolve. Yep, yep, it sounds good. Yep, sounds normal. Now we're starting to bleed health, so we need to we need to stabilize here. Balance budget is good, but I kind of need a damage augment. It's not this. Umbral Crest? I don't think so. Oh, random artifacts. I think I'm going to take this. This might be good. Who do I put it on, though? Who do I put it on? Does he shield himself? Hmm, he does get shield. I think we'll put it on him for now. Oh, these are not ideal for him, huh? Although, I mean, I guess he's going to do a bunch of damage with that. He's he's our off tank now. He's uh, definitely an off tank. Uh, I'm going to put the blue buff on this. I'm going to put the death blade nowhere yet. Why so many Aloons? Are we three-starring Aloon here? Is that what we're doing? Because I don't really want to do that. I mean, I will do that if I have to do that, but I'm, I don't really want to do that. Um, I, I might change my mind on that Aloon if we, <laughs> if we get that. Awkward. Okay. Let's get some Dianas here. Okay, now we've got this. All right, well, this is a better Sage, I guess. Um, do we get rid of the Aloon now is the question. I think we do, right? I think we do. Yeah, I don't want Aloon anymore. And I want... I already have Janna in, so yeah, we don't need that. You go here. Um, man, this blue buff. I think I'll put it on her. That's fine. Whatever. Uh, what did what did he get? He got diamond hands and tricksters. Okay. Well, that'll stop him from taking damage here for a sec. Maybe enough time for us to win. Mm, we need to do some more damage, guys. No, that's not it. Jenna, Jenna, shield. No. Too, too bad. Too bad. Oh, we got some really good units now. All right. That seems fair. A support item to each champion. Uh, what do we want? Uh, probably this. Actually, we're going to take the lease in. I don't even care if it's got Ryan Dwins. We're taking the lease in. Okay, we're full Sage now, and we're four Dragon Lord? No, three Dragon Lord, but full Sage. Four Sage, three Dragon Lord. This is the nice thing of this comp is that every Sage gives you extra. Every Dragon Lord gives you extra. You're not waiting for like two, three of a kind to increase your synergy bonuses. I like that. I like that very much. Okay, you're definitely going in the team. You're definitely coming out of the team. You're not going in the team. You're not going in the team. You're going in the team. You're getting a Blacksmith's Forge. Oh, this looks really good. Wit's End and Blighting Jewel on him. I mean, okay. Okay. I guess this is good. Uh, I guess I put this here. Uh, actually, we, we go like this. Um, we still need more. Now we're going to 
Now we're going to roll. I should roll first. I always get... Oops, we don't want a loon anymore. Um, I always get too excited. There's two-star Diana. Now I don't want to roll anymore because... Oh no, I already have a two-star Diana, so it's okay to get the next one. Okay, we're going to keep rolling a little bit. Oh, there's the Annie. That's really good. We're going to win this, right? Come on, Diana, you could do this. What is Wukong? Yeah, he's... Is he doing lots of damage or what? What's he doing? Are you doing damage? Yes, he's definitely doing damage. I would say so. Okay, good. Uh, we could actually give him... Oh, no, I can't give him anything. We could have given him Deathblade, though. Maybe we take that off. Um, we could actually give him the Deathblade. And him a Hand of Justice. This actually is pretty good. Uh, I'm still waiting on more items on there. But now we have the Annie. So, do we take anything out for the Annie? Oh, yes, this. We take this out for the Annie. Yay! Annie! Anythings. Okay, we're going to do this. Actually, we're going to go like this. This is what we're going to go like. Uh, I want Annie in the middle. I want Diana off to the side a little bit. Uh, and then now we're going to keep rolling a little bit while they, while they resolve their differences over there. All right, three more Dianas, we're good. Three more Dragon Lord, uh, three more, um, ja Dragon Lord. Three more Janna, and we're good. Um, what's this guy? Yeah, this Morgana is doing good. This Wukong is uh, actually kind of stealing the show with those blacksmith gloves. That is kind of fun. It's a little too RNG for me, but uh, it's kind of fun. It's cool. I'll take a Morgana. No, I don't want Thresh. Definitely don't want Thresh. I have two star Zyra. We're probably not going three star, although I always end up three starring her by accident somehow. Uh, we are looking for another crown guard on Diana. Would be really nice. Um, and what else are we looking for? Ooh, champion duplicator is nice. Another Diana is nice. Nautilus is, I suppose, nice. Uh, we don't need those, uh, although it's nice of you to think about us. Uh, okay, so what do we want here? We could go Nasher's Tooth, I guess. I just don't know if that's amazing on her. I think it's better to go double crown guard, to be honest. This is a full champion duplicator, so if we get another... Um, Wukong, right? I feel like it's worth rolling here. I hope it's worth rolling anyway. Oh, there's another Annie that is really good. Oh, there's another Lee Sin. Don't care that much about Zyra, but Lee Sin we definitely like. Okay, we've definitely uh, stabilized. For sure, this four sage giving us thirty percent omnivamp to. Oh my God, Wukong had a sniper's focus there. That's pretty sick. <laughs> okay, now we have a two star Wukong with a light shield crest and seeker's arm guard. Takes down takedowns increase the holder's armor, magic resist, and ability power by ten. Increase to fifteen if they score the kill. Okay, this is actually. This is kind of insane. I kind of want this on my Annie. Right? Like, the, the stuff that you can get from that is uh, pretty wild. Okay, we've got a three-star Janna with no items. We're one away. One off of all of these, actually. One more Diana, one more Annie, one more Morgana, and we get uh, a little bit stronger. We could put the Morellos on Morgana. We do have an Annie, though, so we already have the burn. I feel like that's not really necessary. Um... Lee Sin is rocking the damage. He's kicking people left, right, and center. Diana. This is a really strong team. This is what I'm talking about. Like, this is this is fully forcible. Fully forcible. We all we have is, you know, two decent casting stats. Um Yeah, this is fully forcible. But I mean, okay, the the uh this helps. This helps. Isn't Azania isn't a forbidden idol? Uh you don't give shields though, do you? No, that's not going to be right for you, but that's okay. Um, let's keep going. 
Let's see if we can get... No, we're not going to go three-star that. I think this is okay. We just wait. We don't need to roll. We're not in danger here or anything, so I don't mind. I'm going to probably swap these over. Actually, I might put I might put him right in the middle because Annie's a little bit low, but I think he'll sweep around and catch this guy. Yeah, he does. Nice. Diana at the top. Wrecking faces. Uh, does Crown Guard... Does this affect Crown Guard? That would be pretty good too, right? If you had like a Crown Guard, you get like an automatic 50%. Is Diana going to tank this thing? Oh, she doesn't quite tank the whole thing. That's okay. That's alright. This is going to be hard to get through. This, the, this guy's crazy. He does a lot of damage, but uh, so does Wukong, honestly. Come on, Wukong. Show them the damages. This guy's not taking any damage. Okay, that's fine. Don't take any damage then. That's fine. Don't take damage. No problem. No problem, pretty octopus. You have no gold. Good luck with this. Uh, I feel like the gloves here would be pretty good on Janna. Unfortunately, it's on a Lissandra, but like, what am I... Oh, yeah, I guess we get it. I think we get it. I think that's the best. I mean, there's nothing else that's going to give us two items. I feel like that's pretty good. We don't need almost any of these. Yeah, we're, I mean, we could have given Lee Sin something, but the Janna, at least this gives her the option of having a good item or two, right? See, there you go, the crit. That That's going to be kind of worth it. All right, there we go. Nice. Now we try to level up. Uh, who we got left here? That guy's uh, kind of scary. I'm going to put my Janna over here. Wukong here. Him here. I'm going to sort of spread out my front line a little bit more. They all do good damage and healing, so it's good to spread them out a little bit. Diana should tank this guy. Yeah, see, they're all tanking individual people. Uh, Wukong is tanking two people, but that's fine. He will eventually just go do Wukong things and kill them all. Yeah, this is super easy. She got actually three-star Alun. Interesting. Alun with a sniper's focus. Is that good? Apparently not. But that was a... I think that was a ghost. We're down to five? Yeah, that was a ghost, I think. Uh, oh, that's, that's not required. What do we do now? What are we looking for? Fifth Sage. We need a thing for that. I guess it's the Zaya. That's what we're looking for now, is the Zaya. Okay. Oh, that's right. She's got that. Okay, that's why we need this over here. Fair. Maybe we put it like this. No, we need to be like this, right? I think this is good. Uh-oh. Three star. Three star danger. Three star danger. Stranger danger. Oh, God. Come on, Wukong. Oh, actually, it's this uh, Lee Sin on the side that's just kicking everybody's face. Yeah, they don't even... Haven't come close yet, although the bard just came online. No. Nope. No chance. Sorry, South Relic. Try a new comp. Build your own comp, you meta loser. All right, I've played Bard before, and I, I did mention my in my video that I feel really dirty, and I do still kind of feel like a little unwashed because of that Bard play, so forgive me, Bard. Oh, God, is this? Oh, no, it's not. I mean, honestly, if this were Crab Wave, we, we'd still win, but I was a little scared there. Forbidden Idol sucks. Forbidden Idol sucks. And then this is a terrible combination, too, because you're... 50% of your shields are given away so that this shield, this actually does less damage. Yeah, that's a crappy combination, but that's okay. Okay, we're level 8. Now, here's the last time I played this. I had a big problem at level 8 because I couldn't get any item, or I couldn't get any of the 5 costs I needed. Because at level 8, you still have a relatively low chance of getting the 5 costs you want. So, do I just go to 9? What do I do? This is an item, this is both item anvils. We need something for this. I'm going to take the Rabadons. If I get a better option, though. No, no, not really, hey? Uh, I could get the Gargoyles. I could get Morellos on this, though, too. That is pretty good. Or I could take this. I think we take this. This goes here. This goes here. 
And we have no extra units to put in. Oops. Oops. Do we put in a second any two? Oh, we put in an invoker. That'd be nice. Nope, not getting those guys. I'll put in a second Annie. That'd be funny. I'll put in an invoker. Yeah, the reason we put the cap on her, we got two sort of mix items. They're sort of sort of DPS and they're sort of tanky. Um, they're mostly tank because of the stats. Uh, they give you know health. They give a little bit of AP and a little bit of armor. Um, but the Ravidons is giving us a huge boost, boost in damage as well, so she still does pretty good damage, although not as much uh, as she, she could do. Um, but you can see here, she blocked the majority of the damage, so she's still doing, you know, she's doing pretty well. Let's just say that, she's doing pretty well. I feel like we need to, oops, we need to maybe just go level 9 and get another invoker maybe do we get a lilia before we get this because we need to get we want to get the zaya because that gives us five dragon lord but we're not like we don't have we need we need more money <clears throat> let's go nine and we'll get it this is fine three invokers doesn't do much but you know that's fine this guy's got a kench with oh that's these gloves as well okay well i feel good about that Annie, can you stay alive? Are you staying alive? Janet, shield her. Shield her. Shield. Okay, that was pretty good. Sorry, dude. What are we down to? Down to four. This, I mean, honestly, I've played this the last few days. I've forced it every single time I've played it. I have gone eighth. There are games when you just go eighth. You just low roll everything. I had a game where I couldn't find a, a, a Diana 2. I had Diana 1 the entire game. I had one sitting on my bench, and I couldn't do anything about it. it that happens. Uh, I'm a little worried that we're going to, the game is going to end here, so why don't we do something. Put another Wukong in. Yeah. Let's do this. Let's put them here. Uh, what's this? Oh, Spectral. Okay. So you're going to jump to the other side of the map. I kind of still want you to have the Randuins, though, so you're kind of just going to jump back here. Kind of uselessly. Yeah, I guess you just teleport. <laughs> it's kind of funny. Run right into the right into the gnar. Probably not the best place for you, friendo. Yeah, we rolled all the way to nine. Now we have no money. I'm a little bit worried about that, but uh, the chance of us finding a Rakan is a little bit better. I feel like the stun will do us pretty well, but I also feel like we probably have this. I say cautiously. Diana is still alive. The rest of the team is going down. Maybe she stays alive a little longer? No, this guy is... Oh my god, this chick is crazy back there. All right, all right, we gotta figure this out. Okay, we almost did it. Did you see that? We almost did it. That was really close. If we can get a Zaya here. Oh, what else could we get? Uh, Bruiser, uh, Duelist, Ghostly. Uh, I'm gonna take the ghostly emblem put that on oh no i took it off annie i'll put it on the uh, what's his name Lee Sin. that's fine okay got the ghostly there oh my god three what wait what another two-star wukong i'll take it i'll take it what's this infinity gambler's blade Okay, I mean, do we get three star Wukong? Is that just what we do here? I think we're not going to have a chance. I think, you know, if we win, okay, if we lose here, we don't die and we have one chance to get a three star Wukong. But if we don't, I think three star Wukong might be the only way we do win unless we get a three star. I don't know, maybe we just roll for the three star Wukong. It would be fun, right? It would be pretty fun. I feel like Wukong's items here are probably pretty good. I mean, him warping to the back line and just taking a whole bunch of aggro probably wasn't that great for us. So I feel like this is better, and he's probably got a much better, you know, chance to win this game for us. Yeah. Thank you very much, and enjoy. Uh, GG. And, uh, yeah, that was fun. We'll uh, see you guys in the next video.